Oh my goodness. Hello, hello. <laughs> hi, Tamsy. Hi, Sophie. Hi, Brayden. Hi, L. Hi, Darkness. Hi, Raylene. Hi, Aara. Hello, hello. Oh my goodness, being spammed. Yes, I am back. Um, I'm I'm stuck in Honkai. I can't do much without progressing the story, so I was like, I need to come on and play the game. Also, um, I noticed I had another emote, animated emote slot, so we have a new little animated emote. It's a little peeking icon. Kind of like the lurk one. Kind of like the lurk one, but cuter. <laughs> I don't know. That's cute. I like it. <laughs> But yes, hello, hello. Uh, I hope everyone has had a good week. Everyone's Friday is going well. Yeah, I are. Uh, it was someone on Vgen. It was actually pretty cheap. I feel like it was like 20 bucks or something. I don't know. And that's like Canadian. So even less money American. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, I wanted to play some more so I can progress more on the side. What have I done without you guys? When was the last time I streamed? Two days ago? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I just, um, I did a companion quest for, I don't even know who the fuck it was for. It was like, Asta was in it and like Arlen, but I think it was mostly mainly around Asta. But I hit Equilibrium level two, cause I guess I hit level 30 today on Trailblazer leveling when I was just like running around doing shit. And what the fuck, the Equilibrium like level two fight was easier than the first one. I was like, dude, I just fucking rolled this shit. I don't know if I'm getting better at the game or what, but yeah, I was like, this is easy clap, so. But uh, yeah, I hope everyone's day is doing well. I just got off work and I don't know if I'll stream for as long as I usually do with this game. Like it's been like four hours. I might just stream for like two just cause I wanna, I wanna go exercise more. Um, my, my partner and I kids, we wanna play some Beat Saber later. <laughs> so I was like, okay, I'll stream for a little bit cause I need a, I need a shower, but. I was like, if we're going to go in VR and hit some blocks with our sabers, then I'm not going to bother showering until after all of that. So, yee -hee, I'm stinky. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope everyone's doing well. Uh, I'm going to just hop right over to it because I've been itching to play this game. I don't really have any like new updates. I've been trying to freaking draw some more sketchy, um, sketchy punky things. Um, because I, I need more examples for my, uh, for it. So I was going to do one for, I was going to do one because uh, Cigar is the one who gave me my VGen code. So I was going to surprise them with, uh, with one of them. But uh, I started it and it looked like shit. So I ended it. So I need to, I need to restart it again, but I just haven't like picked up my, picked up my tablet to draw it yet. So, but I need to do that soon because I want to open my VGen commission. So yes, yes. Um, Mia's having a lobby tonight. Come dancies. I'll dancies, but I won't drink. Bless, bless my mother. So yeah, my, my go-to drinks on the weekend when I drink on Saturday are these things called muddlers. Um, I think they're a ca Canadian only brand. I haven't seen them when I've visited America. Uh, I think they're Vancouver based. Um, like that's where they're made. So yeah, they're really yummy. They come in a different, like a bunch of different flavors. There's like fruit punch. Um, there's like this Moscow meal one, but the one I get is the vodka lemonade and it's uh, really yummy. Ashen, hello, hello. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Yeah, Canadian only and not available in Ontario. So I don't really know how far they ship out from like BC, but I'm able to get it. So I'll drink that. And then soju, specifically Chum Churum brand peach soju like it's the best so I asked my mom I was like hey today or tomorrow because I know she's like gonna be in town tomorrow I was like can you pick me up a peach soju for me and she's like did you drink the ones in the fridge already and I was like yes <laughs> I did and she's like okay she's like they don't have any peach soju here I guess she had like already gone in that moment I don't know where she was but I was like She's like, there's no peach soju flavor. And I'm like, okay, don't get me any then. Like, don't waste your money. I'm not going to drink anyone except the peach soju. She went and freaking asked the the staff to go check the back to see if they had any. And they did. But I was like, oh my goodness, mother, you did not have to do that for me. Like, I would have, I have other alcohol at home I could drink if I wanted to. So, 
she's like, no, I'm on a mission. You want it, I'll get it. So, but yeah. Uh, but yeah, so if I do get online today, I'm not going to. I'm not going to drink. I'll smoke, but I'm not going to drink. Um, but yeah, I'm going to hop right into the game. Let me go over here. Game regular. Let me click on this before I change the volume because it's always so loud. What else did I do? I, I just like cleaned up all the um, like quests I had. Mothers do the most. Well, most of them. Yeah, bless her. It's because like I, I have no reason to like go into the city. Sorry, one second. I'm changing all the volume around. I have no reason to go into the city. Oh my god, wait. Let me tell you guys a story. Well, it's not a story. Um, basically, okay, so at my work, they've started doing this like prize raffle draw thing for my team, and my team consists of three people. So like, we're pretty much entered every single month, but then they just like, you know, do a draw to see who wins, but we get like a $50 gift card to wherever we want. And I wanted a Steam gift card, but like, you have to actually like have a Steam account to buy a gift card like online on Steam. Um, and I wasn't about to ask my boss who has no idea what Steam is to go make an account and buy me a gift card. Um, so I was like, oh, I'll just buy a Best Buy gift card because I know they have like physical like gift cards at Best Buy for Steam. Um, yeah, I literally drove 30 minutes all the way to the city where the Best Buy is for the sole purpose of buying this freaking Steam gift card and I get there and I'm like, okay, here's the gift card. I'm going to pay it with this. And like, I showed them my email and they're like, oh, sorry, you can't pay a gift card with a gift card. And I was just like, damn, I drove all the way out here for literally nothing. <laughs> like I just wasted gas. Like that was like an hour trip, 30 minutes there, 30 minutes back just to be told I can't fucking use a gift card with a gift card. Like, and you can't cash out like the Best Buy gift cards either. So I literally just wandered around Best Buy and was like, okay, hey, what can I buy for $50? Cause I'm not coming back here. And I ended up buying a freaking smart skipping rope. <laughs> like it's got like, like the handles like track your like BPM and like, like your heart rate, your calories, like all this shit. So I'm like, fuck it, YOLO. Might as well get something like workouty, I guess, cause I'm trying to lose weight. No, I didn't try it yet, but I showed it to my mom and she's like, ooh, I might try this. Um, it's still sitting on my table, but yeah, I had to make it worth it going out there. I mean, on the way home, I did get sushi and I was always planning to get sushi on the way home, but still the sushi place is only 15 minutes from where I live. So it's like, if I wanted sushi, I didn't have to drive all the way to the city with Best Buy to get it. So, <laughs> you know, Ugh, I was so mad. I'm just doing what my friend and the, the kicker is too, I was going to use that steam gift card because dead by daylight just came out with a new chapter called, um, called All Things Wicked and there's a new survivor and I wanted to buy all of her cosmetics, but it was gonna cost me like $50 to get them all. So I was like, oh, I'll just use my gift card to buy all of them. And then, yeah. Nice. And then, yeah, I just ended up spending my own $50. <laughs> so next time if I win that draw, I'm just gonna do what my friend or like my boss and my friend did is he just bought the Steam gift card, and then he just charged it as like an expense to the company. So, and then they covered it. But still, I was like, Ree! like, I did all that. I drove all the way out there. I still have like PTSD a bit from driving. So I like made the trip out there. Oh, what a day, what a day. Oh, so hi, Jedi. Hello, hello. How are you? Nice. Um, what are we doing again? What have I done? What haven't you guys seen? I don't think I've ever, I don't think I've done anything with the people. Oh, I guess like question. I don't know like what light cones are like good to level. Cause I'm looking at this thing right now and it's like enhance four light cones to level 40. But like, I don't know which light cones I should be leveling and like which ones are good. Like, yeah. I don't know which ones are good. Like, should I just level some random one to level 40 just so I can make it to the next little thingy or I don't even know. You took more VTO. I mean, if you can afford it and you want to, you might as well, so. Pom -pom, we're back. Um, Checking Star Rail stability. Pom Pom needs to focus. Good to see you too. Spatial readout. Back to 
the door. Sorry, I didn't realize it was going to start the conversation with him because I do have this new thing. I do have some like trailblazer level rewards to claim, but I avoided talking to Pom Pom because like we have to talk to him for the main quest. And I didn't know if it would like start dialogue with him that you guys would miss or if I would like, you know, just take me to the menu and have the options of me to like pick. So. Star rail stability keeps rising. 56%. 57%? The new characters are the only reason why. Dude, the unknown is fucking scary. Like, I literally, like, I'm usually looking behind me when I run, but like not constantly. And it's like so unforgiving with his power. Like when he hits you with that like radius and you have to look at him. Like I've been running into so many walls like last night, like just because I'm trying to get this fucking shit off my head. <laughs> Uh, like his infection or whatever and then I'm like oh this is a wall or like this is a rock <laughs> like now I'm gonna get m1 ew he's so creepy when he kicks those pallets or or it I don't know it's like it's the unknown it's an it oh, welcome back to the express you've accomplished your trailblaze mission the express appreciates your but yeah he's uh gonna be an interesting one to go against <laughs> Um, what the? Right away, to avoid encountering the anomalies again, the Express will dispatch shortly and head to a more stable area. Zero, hello, hello. For your safety, please don't leave your seat until the Express has reached How are you? Speed. Not much. I'm gonna play a bit of this so I can progress the story a bit more. Oh, so we didn't even complete. Okay. Bronia. Oh yeah, it was it was Asta's um companion. It was Asta's companion one that we that I unlocked off stream because I remember this visitor verification thing popping up. So you're making me addicted. What do you mean? It's fun, okay? <laughs> I have no issues with this. Ah, Nyota, are you there? Calm down, bitch. It's something super urgent. Is it though? Pom Pom doesn't even want to think about it. Oh, okay. The train's long overdue. Cleaning day is almost upon us. What the fuck? <laughs> Do you not have maids for this? So you want me to come back and help with the cleaning? Not really. But if you're willing to lend a hand, Nyota, that would be great. We're on our way to the nearest Washtopia. What the fuck? <laughs> come back and see me when you have time. Oh. What the heck? Oh, it's another companion one. Look at all my companion quests, Jesus. I'm chilling, about to do my HSR dailies. There you go! Dude, that was so funny yesterday when we were playing Phasmo and you were like, I have to do them, they're gonna reset in like 40 minutes or whatever it was. <laughs> oh my god. Have to do the dailies, I know it all too well. Oh my god, we have so many messages. Hello, Madoc! A song? Oh shit. What is it? Or I'll look at it after. Oh my god, I hate how it's like the Spotify previews are like not showing up on my spot on my Discord right now. I wonder. I had a release radar song from Ramses B today that I was listening to on my daily lunchtime walk now. So um, maybe it was on there. I don't know. I don't remember it being funky, though. I did hear some of Rez's new songs, though. Um, okay, wait. Where? I don't want it to show, like, the preview. One second. Okay, it's like not even opening. Can you just like type to me what the song name is and I will look it up? I'm literally clicking on the link and it's not going anywhere. <laughs> I'll read these in the meantime. What was this? Urgent reports from the logistics team said a number of broken patrol robots from an unknown source were spotted in the restricted zone. They pose a risk to our staff members until the situation is resolved. Non-combatants are advised not to operate alone and should apply for an escort team when the situation demands it. Okay, it's just not logging the list. No one cares. Ramses B. Just invite her. Oh, could do that. Ramses B. What was it called again? I already forgot. Q. 
keep you. Oh, it's on. I hope this isn't blowing everyone's eardrums out. Wait, where is Pom Pom? I need to find him so I can get my levels. I like this. I like this. Oh, I didn't mean to. Why the fuck did this not show up on my Spotify? I can't see. <laughs> Hi, Jern. Hello, hello. Oh, you're using the new emote too. You're using the new emote, the little peak. I'll just be a chibi forever. I don't need to grow up into a full 2D model. Just kidding, I already paid for it. It's happening eventually. <laughs> Yeah, I have a new animated one. It's this little peaky one. Sorry, we're on a music intermission break. Actually, this is a side quest. I'm a speed reader. No, I'm not. I can't read. Oh shit, Zero! Thank you for the sub! Thank you, thank you! Okay, I can use it now. In the dancies. It should be uploaded to my Discord too. That doesn't exist yet. That only select few people have access to. That was a good, th good song, good song. Wait. Sorry, I started playing other music. <laughs> I don't want to, the part of the stream's probably going to get muted, but that's fine. That's okay. <laughs> one of the, one of the videos yesterday or whenever we streamed last when we were watching all those trailers muted some of my stream too, so. What was that? <laughs> what is that? Is that pizza? What the heck? I was gonna wait until my prime ran out on the other account, but I'll sort it out in that spot. Oh, you're good. Oh, you could have waited. It's not like you need to use the emote right away, so. Okay, I just wanna accept my levels. What is he talking about? There are plenty of them throughout the universe. Okay. That's what Pom Pom used to think, but Washtopia's only cleaned the exterior of the train at. Uh, since you only just got. Wait, what? Okay. Is this the main quest? No, it's not. I just want to check my fucking trailblazer level. How is everything? Let me. Oh my god, fucking finally. Look how many things I have to claim. Bitch. No, I did. <laughs> it's super cute. Oh my god, wait. How many things did we get? Oh my goodness, I maxed her out already? As elusive as it may appear. She has no more? Is this it? Well, that was easy. <laughs> okay. Um, let me just see what they want. Big sister, are you? <gasps> she called me a big sister, what? Cute emoticons, look at her. Looks like a little ball sack though. <laughs> of course, what's the matter? Actually, the robot settlement has been met with some issues recently. Big sister, come have a look, please. If you have the time. Don't worry, I'll be right there. But not actually, because we're leaving the planet. <laughs> I'll be waiting for you at... Oh, it's her freaking companion quest. Okay, and then her to... Some good news. Round maze at the space station. 
Can I meet her? I don't remember who she is. Ask her for yourself. I called her and screw him here to talk about some important matters. Come back when you're free and introduce yourself to her. That way she knows who the person that's been testing the simulated universe. Wait, what is this mission? What? Interesting. Okay. Let's go back on the main story. Wait, what the fuck is a trail based continuance? the fuck okay well we're gonna do this one okay hello hello it's about time we hit the road passengers thanks to the three trailblazers the activity of the fragmentum has reached the lowest level and the readings regarding the status of the star rail have returned to normal pom pom will dispatch the express shortly and we'll be leaving yarillo six please be seated and say your goodbyes to this planet where are we going is the question. Prison? What? Wait, what? What is happening? Yan Ching. Yes, General. Watch this person carefully. <gasps> Do you remember me? I remember. Of five people, three must pay a price. <laughs> you are not one of them, Jin Yuan. Who? <laughs> of five people, three must pay a price. <laughs> Are one of them. What in the horror movie is this? Always oh, got his little tunes, his little headphones in. I'll, I'll be there soon. What did I tell you? He's definitely sleeping in. We trailblazers can go days without sleep, but when we do hit the hay, we have to make up for it. Anyway, no point wasting our time in the corridor. Sleeping in full outfit, no one right. The conductor wants us to attend a warp navigation meeting. Same old location, apparently. And we can't be late. Let's head over. This happy music oh, on this the side way. of the room hallway. You drew the short straw. It's your turn to wash the coffee cups this week. Hi, babe. How much Beat Saber are we going to be Beat Sabering later? Morning. You're very punctual. And a wonderful morning to you, oh, Himiko. I can't remember the last time I got such a bit. Did you guess it? Use what? <laughs> Use the trailblazing right. of Yurilo Six is drawn to a close, and the Astral Express must depart for the next planet. But where? What's the Not next planet like? Yet. Oh. We'll make an official announcement in the meeting, but I'm keeping you in suspense for now. Damn it. The meeting will start soon. Karina, hello. I'm doing good. And the the Star Rail's going good. We beat the first planet, so we're literally just about to embark to the next planet. I hope you're doing good too though. And are we playing not modded? Uh as much as your little noodle arms can be. You know, it's my calves that are burning from that that walk earlier on my lunch but um does modded work now like multiplayer and stuff i don't know i thought we were just gonna press play at the same time and like <laughs> i don't i don't know that's why i asked <laughs> yeah i'm excited to see what this next planet is gonna be like Ooh. passengers the warp navigation meeting has officially begun yeah where are we going where Firstly, are we going pom pom wants to congratulate you the nameless for successfully resolving the problems at this stop the Express is now able to continue along the Star Rail. The three of us actually pulled it off, huh? It's time for your conductor, <clears throat> that's me, to reveal the name of our next stop. Long time no see, <laughs> Astral Express crew. <laughs> it's Kafka. Why are we angry at her? I came at a good time. You're all here. Every single one. 
No need for the mysterious introduction, Stellaron Hunter. <laughs> Himiko, correct? I love this girl. Apologies for interrupting your little get-together, but I'm sure once you've heard my request, you'll forgive me. I'd like you to make a... destination alteration. Do we get to meet her? I've seen your face before, Stellaron Hunter. Even if it was only on a Corporation Wanted poster. They were offering quite the bounty. Mom. Dead Mom. or alive. Do you know the figure? Doesn't concern me. Then again, a Corporation bounty is a compliment, not an insult. Don't you think? The higher the figure, the bigger the compliment. You wanted criminals sure know how to look on the bright side of things. I will say, Herta certainly paid you all a compliment. A maniac that claims he can see destiny, leading a bunch of wild lunatics in pursuit of the most dangerous objects in the universe. And Herta doesn't give out compliments very often. In pursuit of the most dangerous objects in the universe, huh? Well, in that sense, you astral expressors and I are cut from the same cloth. You're in the wrong place, Kafka. We're not about to accept your request, and we're not about to get into bed with a Stellaron hunter. It was nice. Speak for you. yourself, Himiko, yeah, okay? Come to me in my chat. We'll, we'll all jump we in there. Continue our little discussion. We'll all jump in there. Have you guys heard of the Law Fu? But Sienjo Lawfu? It belongs to the Hexa fleet of the Sienjo Alliance. We've heard of it. And L, you used to like this guy. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. I'm pretty sure you could do the regular multiplayer with the little... Okay, as long as it works, yeah. Also tacos, what? I don't know what I'm having for dinner yet. Darkness, you're always eating. Is this dinner time for you? <laughs> yeah, Zero, help me. <laughs> help me, Kafka, I'm stuck. The mums are fighting, but Kafka's the better mm. mom. Look at her. What you haven't heard is that it's currently very close to you. A couple of warp jumps away, in fact. She's got your glasses, Zero. Not to mention, 45 system hours ago, a Stellaron burst occurred on the Lafu. An unexpected calamity, don't you think? What exactly are you Stellaron hunters trying to do? The Sienjo Alliance aren't us. They won't give you time to explain. Once you draw the attention of the hunt, you become their prey. The Alliance will hunt you to the end of the universe. Stop speaking in riddles, Kafka. Say what you have to say. It's simple. That Stellaron has nothing to do with us, but the Sienjo is convinced that we're responsible. My companion, Blade, has been taken away by the Cloud Knights. I want to bring him back, resolve this Stellaron crisis, and clear our names. Wait, isn't... Is this not the guy that was in, um... Don Hung's dream? The nightmare that he was just having? Eh, coffee. I made tea today, but I let it steep for like three minutes too long, and then it tasted like shit, so I threw it out. <laughs> well, actually, I drank half of it, and then I threw it out. <laughs> Nothing to do with you? Yeah, he was okay. right. Sounds like a weird coincidence to me. You just happened to show up after the Stellaron burst. Also, we're not your friends. Why should we care if a Stellaron hunter is innocent, hmm? Yeah. We should seal the Stellaron. Maybe we can sell our friendship. Is there anything in this? Is there anything in this for us? No! Why are we listening to her? The Alliance is strong. Is a single Stellaron burst really too much for them to handle? We're the crew of the Astral Express, not some squad of Stellaron stealing super specialists. You could, of course, not get involved. Knowing that the Stellaron hasn't yet affected this region of space, you could make the jump and arrive at the next world. But sooner or later, the Star Rail here will be more blocked off than it was before. I can tell you what the future holds. If you don't go to the Law Fu, the Stellaron will eventually contaminate the entire ship, and over half of the inhabitants will perish. Oh, you brave and fearless trailblazers. 
you benevolent, nameless. Can you really remain Damn, she's got us. to that? She knows. This companion of yours, Blade, he perished too, right? Everyone is so aggressive and then still can just be like, well. No comment. No comment. Here are the coordinates. It's up to you how to proceed. Our destinations may differ, but the orbits of the stars will eventually converge. See you later. <sighs> March, get done hung. Oh my god, we have to vote on the destination? Oh. Little cutscene. Whoa, what are you doing here? Hmm. I gave him the lowdown. Hey, remember what I said, okay? We're gonna vote against it. I'm not gonna take orders from that woman. Says you, March. I'm voting... I mean, obviously this is scripted. It's gonna make us go either way, isn't it? Are you okay, Don Hung? March brought you up to speed, I assume. <clears throat> I'm fine. And yes, I'm up to speed. Good. In that case, with regard to the matter at hand, let's vote to decide our next move. Our Stellaron hunter claims that a Stellaron burst has occurred on the Sienjo La Fu, and that we're in the vicinity. If we head for the La Fu, we may have the chance to save many innocent lives. However, it's also possible that our Stellaron hunter is lying and using us for her own ends. Neither Welt nor I believe that she's telling us the truth, but we can't just ignore the intel Let's she's given us. Let's go. Hi, Ozo. So, we are about to hold a democratic vote on whether to set a course for the Sien Zhou. All those in favor, hold out your hand. All those against, keep your arms by your side. Three, two, We're going. One. Hands up. Four Wait. against one. Well, it looks like the Astral Express Wait. crew has a majority vote to Wait. head for the Sien Joe. Literally, March just said that she's like, we're all voting against it, right? What the fuck she put on her hand? You little cunt. Yeah, didn't you say you were voting against? Uh, calm down and thought about it a bit. If it turns out that woman isn't lying, then a lot of innocent people are going to get hurt. Wow. Now's the time for thinking about other people. Don Hong is probably like, these two bitches. We said we were going to vote. Like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, March, we love all you. Right, all right, all right. I think we're all used to March's modus operandi by now. So, Don Hung, you want to stay here? Yes. I'm staying this time. <gasps> Who's replacing you, though? In that case, Welt. No, I want you. Blazing expedition. I know you've been itching to get out there for a while now, but make sure you take good care of the two of them. I don't want this man. Don't worry. Destination Sienjo, here we come. We want Himiko. The train is about to make the jump. Five, four. You think they'd give us like seat belts on this thing? And there's March again, just standing. You know who she reminds me of? Like people like riding the Sky Train, and that they don't want to hold on to anything. So they're just gonna brace themselves for impact. <laughs> That's a Sienjo ship? It looks even bigger than Yurilo 6! For the Sienjo, these ships are their planets. Terrestrial environments Not are cradles a great guy, that how dare. civilizations but to survive <laughs> and then develop. Some of those civilizations progress further, constructing spacefaring vessels, which allow them to voyage into the unknown. How many zones are, like, technically Sienjo out? We got the Herda space station. Um... You really have six, so like the overworld and underworld, this world, and is there just one, one more? Oh, sorry, I'm yawning. I've only glimpsed it a few times, but she leave my warps alone. It's as magnificent as I remember. You okay there? 
What's with all the lonely nostalgia vibes? Do you like know what his name is, March? Like, he probably was born here. <sighs> this is the Astral Express. I repeat, this is the Astral Express. We have arrived in Sienjo territory. Requesting landing permission from ground control. From the bridge, I mean. Welcome to Lofu Skyport. Starsky Ven. Please await transfer. Please wait transfer. One more Please agent. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna catch up in no time. Um is it stuck on repeat? <sighs> now you know how I feel when you copy me. March just thrown shade at us? Something's not right. The signal is still repeating, but no one is guiding us into dock. Maybe the Stellaron hunters were telling the truth. It seems like something really did happen to the Sienjo. A vessel arrives at a deserted spaceport. Isn't that how, like, loads of horror movies start? Dead space. Dun dun dun. Let's not let our imaginations get the better of us. Are we all not gonna like notice that like the transmission is also like fucked? Oh, <laughs> still, the like it doesn't signal. sound right. Yes, it's still on repeat. Ah, oh, there we go. The jade gate now opening. Like, why is it cutting out? Welcome, guests from afar. Please proceed to dock in accordance with the guidance. Why is everyone in this game so pretty? Huh? They are. Is this still automated? And we're totally fine with it. The signal broke off. Seems that's all there is. We should get going. Himiko, stay vigilant back here on the express. They've purged the Uggies? Relax. <laughs> I've got Don Hung here with me. Um, Trailblazers sure assemble! Prepared before you set off. What do we even have to prepare for? Before we set off, I need to clarify the aim of this journey with you. The Stellaron Hunters have given us a lot to consider, and a lot to doubt. But the most important part of this expedition is- Saving the people. Sampling the local delicacies, getting to know the people with power, the Stellaron. <laughs> what are these options? <laughs> Precisely. The Stellaron hunters clearly have ulterior motives. However, knowing what they're all about, and given the focus of Kafka's words, I have no doubt that the Sienjo is dealing with a Stellaron. The Alliance and the Express haven't had any previous dealings, so our arrival might not receive the warmest welcome. But as trailblazers, we're not in this for fame or gain. We just need to do Fame everything in our power to assist the CNG. Traded one monotone companion for another. Disaster. Facts. Always keep that in mind. And don't forget the way of the trailblaze. Explore, understand, establish, and connect. What was our motto? Manipulate, gaslight. <laughs> you played Mass Effect, right? Yeah. Um, well, I've, I haven't played the first one. I've beat the second one and i only played like a few hours of the first or sorry the third one yeah i really did enjoy the second one though let's go i want to know what this place is gonna look like we were just in the mines and on like a snowy world oh this is not what uh, i was look. expecting it's just containers as far as the eye can see this area isn't for receiving guests it's for unloading cargo who decided to send us this way you only played the third one. Such a was huge it good? port and not a soul in sight. It gives me the creeps. Mm, yet someone opened the gate for us. Huh. Ah, stop talking. If there is someone here, they're in my bad books already. Mr. Yang, Wait, the what third had multiplayer? Do? What? I didn't even notice. <laughs> we should start with the person who opened the Jade Gate. If it turns out they're not friendly, then at least they've already made things easier for us. If it turns out they were just doing their job, then we can ask them what happened here. Mm, you're pretty decisive. That's Mr. Yang. This is child's play for him. 
He's dealt with all kinds of dangers before. Let's move. Keep your wits about you. Wow, you think they would, like, put him on the first mission with us to, like, show us the ropes, how to, like, handle ourselves, like, keep calm in, like, situations, but in the, instead they just let, like, three kids go and just do whatever the fuck they want? <laughs> I was just thinking you would be a paragon. I love that game. Oh, oh, Garrus is great. Okay, what's around here? These looks kind of intense. <gasps> Mr. Yang, someone's hurt. Up, up ahead. You're hurt, son. Uh, try not to talk. March, use your six-phased ice to stop the bleeding. Go easy. We don't want to add frostbite to his list of complaints. I'm on it. What the fuck? She can use her ice to stop it? <laughs> I remember back when it released, if you bought the game secondhand, you had to spend like ten dollars for the online pass. Oof. This area saw and a seven fierce day fire nice. only recently. Let's keep searching. There might be other survivors. Shit. Do I need to like level myself? Up ahead. Please leave me. Oh, okay. Oh my god, I like how like everything's like like the treasure looks all different. Like this is the um the purple what? shit, right? Yeah. That's so cool. <laughs> Better than Diablo soap. <laughs> so true though <laughs> still waiting on news there's a mass effect 4 what clearly i don't keep up, up to date on mass effect everywhere. anymore the silver lining is that based on what we can see no civilians were caught up in the battle yeah but who came over here everyone's like clutching their head i'm guessing the cnjo must have evacuated the port immediately leaving the soldiers to deal with the crisis but as for these Corroded to monsters. True, true. <laughs> Must search for all the treasure. Oh, I wanna. Up ahead. Okay. What about you? Up ahead. Okay, never mind. <laughs> The armored soldier has already passed away. Surprisingly, there are no visible wounds on the body. Uh, he looks like he's breathing to me. <laughs> Careful. We've never seen this kind of life form before. We have different ones. Got the prince? Let's make it quick. Ha! Time for a shot. Oh my god, they actually do like quite a bit of damage. This was a two-parter. Let's make it quick. Rules are made to be broken. Wait, what? Hello? Rude. That's better. Much better. Be even scared to buy Which it for micro tra oh, microtransactions. It's the wind moving his body, his dead body. Mr. Yun, fall back. Sorry. They're Mara struck. We've already lost them. We gotta RP our way over. <laughs> hey, you there? We need your help. She's cute. Yeah, look at all the little like gold leaf things on them. Thanks for 
saving beauty from the bees. <laughs> Pleasure. But are you thanking us or giving yourself a compliment? Probably heal someone. Ouch. <laughs> Oh my god, I forgot these things here. Dude, that is so annoying. That's better. Please don't die, please don't die. Just just a little something. Not bad. Five points. Oh no, I don't have any left. I'll go <laughs> See, like, how did she not kill him? Time for a shot. Much better. Mediocre. Deal myself. I'm asking questions. Oh my god, my dude's Let's almost dead too. <laughs> Let's make it pop. Naughty child. <laughs> Not bad. Five po I'll go. <laughs> okay, we're good. We're good. We Ms. are Tim good. The Mara struck have been repelled, but. There could be other dangers nearby. The Mara struck. The situation is serious. <gasps> Look Allow at her. us to escort you back to the Skyfaring Commission. Immediately. Calm down. I heard you. It'd be rude of me to depart without thanking our benefactors. My name is Ting Yun. I'm the Amicaster for so the Walkthrough cute. Skyfaring Commission Merchant Guild. May I venture to know the illustrious names of my heroes? Illustrious names? Uh, sure. I'm March 7th. This is Mr. Yang. Oh, Mr. Welt Yang. And this is... I'm the galactic baseballer. <laughs> I'm not saying that. I'm Yuna. I see. The ears are so cute. Well, Look at her. thank you for coming to our aid. Even her outfit. Although, there is one thing I don't understand. Starskiff Haven is under lockdown. Since none of you are Sienjo residents, may I ask how you came to be here? Someone let us in. If you can't offer an explanation, I'm afraid these Cloud Knights will have to escort you out. Uh, we called for port transfer and got no response, but then someone opened the Jade Gate for us. When we arrived, there was no one to be found, so we started to make our own way through. How can that be? My ship was the last one into port before the Jade Gate was shut. The Skyfaring Commission has already locked down Starskiff Haven entirely. We're telling the truth. You could verify it yourself by checking the access history of the Jade Gate. We, we found a strange ourselves when the gate opened, but no one came to greet us. And the fact that we were opened into a fucking cargo bay, like... <laughs> I mean, that also probably looks pretty sus on her end, too. Like, if you were going to enter here and someone let you in, you think they'd let you in through the entrance, not, like, the back door? You were with the Astral Express. Shit, did we not say that? You've heard of us? Indeed, I have. Oh, you've arrived at a bad time. The Sienjo has suffered an incident. Whether you're here for leisure, treatment, or trade... I'm afraid you won't be able to go through with it. For your safety, you should hurry to Central Starskiff Haven and take refuge. I'll take you to Madame Yukong of the Skyfaring Commission and let her decide how to proceed. I'm surprised she didn't say, like, you guys should just go back from whence you came. We caught wind of the incident you mentioned. That's why we're here, Miss Tingyun, to help the Sienjo seal the Stellaron. <laughs> your actions have already revealed your kind hearts to me. Uh, sadly, I can't make you any promises. 
you're outsiders, and only Madame Yukong has the authority to consider your offer. Well, don't worry. Madame Yukong is kind-hearted, too. Come on now. I'll lead the way. I want to fight more people. <gasps> what is this? Ice is nowhere material on its own. However, the ice are, ice shirts glittering with strange colors before you must have come from none other than, than a specific girl, you know? Sorry, I'm exploring. Oh. I don't know who to hit. Sometimes it like auto moves me to like hit a specific thing. Oh, I didn't realize that I didn't heal everyone back up. Whoops. I'm asking questions. Test. Rules are made to be broken. Uh, is there like any way to get around them from like not Let's healing? Or is that just something Let's make it quick. that these guys do? Fuck, I can't restore anyone. That's better. That's just what they do. There's no power like team power. me. I mean, I just need to, like, level my people. Like, I've been capped out because I wasn't, like, I hadn't done the quest to hit Reach Equilibrium 2 until, like, just before I started streaming, so. I should, wait, there's nothing even over there. One over there for nothing. <sighs> so I'm just, like, looking. Looking at all the things. Yeah, oh, that's what I did. I went and I went to every single zone, killed all the formidable foes, and uh, like got all the treasures and whatever those little guys are. Those monsters the back there. They were no monsters. Well, those were not to be confused with monsters, benefactors. We call them Mara Struck. What the fuck is that? Is this an enemy? Is it a puzzle? What is this? Oh god. Hexanexus is a space junction device made by a mysterious organization in the Artisanship Commission. Or Artisanship Commission. If attracted almost no notice Oh, it attracted almost no notice because it's difficult to understand. Interact with the Hexanexus to activate it and solve the puzzle. Rotate the corresponding area of the Hexanexus so that the physical block of the Hexanexus corresponds to the plates on both sides. Oh lord. Oh my goodness. What the fuck? Why are you gifting some weird not weird people, but like post Malone, what the fuck? Switch between different faces of the heck Oh wait, rotate the face. Rotate the viewing angle. Wait, I don't get it. Match the ethereal and corporal faces of the hex nexus with the plates on the two sides. What? Oh. Somehow I figured it out <laughs> without knowing what I was supposed to do. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna fight them yet just because I need. I definitely need more levels, but I will do that later. 
why have we stopped? Don't worry, miss. I have a favor to ask. <laughs> That's all. Favor? Count me out. What if we do it wrong and you get your cloud cronies to throw us in jail? I shouldn't have doubted Dude, you. I can't Please. read March. Like, That's she's so fucking apologies. random. Our road ahead is barricaded. Do you see? The soldiers stationed here must have moved these into a roadblock. Let's like push them aside together. <laughs> They're extremely heavy. Even with all of us, we wouldn't be able to move one. Not that I'm doubting your skill, but I'd feel terrible if you hurt yourself in the process. If I'm not mistaken, the containers in the trove of verdure can be moved around using a control panel. You've already put on quite the show. Do you think you'll be able to find and operate the control panel? Should be simple, right? <laughs> right, so why don't you do it? <laughs> I right. knew it. This will be a breeze for you. Why does she sound like she's kind of condescending to us? We just need to pass through here, take the barge to Starskiff Haven, and we'll be safe. You know, you sound sweet enough, but you were talking about getting us escorted away by your cloud knights. If it weren't for Mr. Yang... You misunderstand. If you were in my Get shoes around. right now, wouldn't you want to keep your guard up? Ah, uh, true. Answer me. Zero points. I'll go easy. Oh, this one feels so much harder. Rules are made to be broken. She definitely sounds less like she has ultra. Yeah, right. <laughs> Kill both of them. Let's go. Not bad. Five points. Answer me. I was hoping he would follow up. I still don't understand exactly when he follows up. Let's make it quick. Time for a shot. Your answers? Test. Reach the end of the story in your own way. Keep at it. easy enough. <laughs> uh, it's based on the number of debuffs on the enemy. Oh, I think the dots under his portrait indicate shows how many follow-ups he has, unless... Oh, okay. I thought with March of, she just followed up if you had a, like, she had a shield on you and you got attacked. You work for the Skyfaring Commission, so I assume you're aware of its destructive power. Yes, I am. As an Amicassador, I've been to many planets and seen my fair share of Stellaron corrosion. Sorry, I want to wait for them to finish talking. Okay. Ooh, What the fuck are you? The dots are just from his alt. They're guaranteed fall of checks with okay. Got the defense. Answer me. This is our chance. Yeah. 
Naughty child, nap time. Just. Free. I'll go easy this time. <laughs> well, that yeah. was easy. Time for it. <laughs> the dots are. Oh, sorry. Ally attack, rather. Just as my calculations predicted. So easily. This is our chance. That's better. I'm asking questions. Answer me. Let's go. Your answer. Oh, I forgot it was two. Oh. I like really like the design on these little fishies though. That'll take more than medicine. What they explode? What the fuck? Okay, okay. Just as my calculations predict. <gasps> What's up here? <laughs> treasure? Hell yeah. I can sniff out the treasure, guys. I should probably heal myself though. Where was a thingy that I could heal myself on? It's like the first thing I've collected here yet. Same, they remind me of the mix of big, yeah. Big eyeball goldfish. Mm. I want to explore still. I'm addicted to exploring. Oh, what are you? He's just chilling. I'm asking questions. A test. Free. Let's. <laughs> oh my God, Straw! Thank you for the follow. Um. I should probably heal myself. Oh my god, what, how did they do so much damage? Stop attacking me. I'm gonna just chill inside your water bottle. Thank you. I needed that. Oh my god, stop. Stop! Attack someone else! Everyone else has full health! Please, thank you. Oh, that one didn't res though. Sick. That's better. I'm asking questions. Ew, uh, cause it's slime in my straw. What? <laughs> There's no slime in my straw. And koi fish are very koi. Oh my god, Jenna. Also, hi Eli. Hello, hello. Let's make it quick. Yeah. Naughty child. Hmm. There's no power like oh my god. I'll go. <laughs> okay, we're good, we're good. Oh. Well, you know what? The joke's on you. Because I don't even- I'm not even drinking from a water bottle. I'm drinking from a little 
sippy cup that has a straw. So technically you could be the straw. Keep at it. Keep I'm just gonna at it. heal this way. <laughs> I really like the way she says naughty child. Also, what the hell is this? It's like a bird. Oh, this is like, um... Is this like the... What should I call it? Um, the flying helicopter things in the other one. Your answers. Foster shed, thank you. And stretch. Let's go. Where's the redeem for having an app? I need that. Are made to be broken. I need to get rid of some damage. I'm oh asking questions. Hell yeah. I need that, but for me. <laughs> Do it. Let's make you. Reach the end of the story in your own way. Mm. Keep at it. Keep at it. I never use these restore things, so might as well just use them. They're like everywhere. Got the defense. Got the defense. The test. Zero points. <laughs> this is our chance. for a while. This is our chance. Boom. Easy clap. There's one over Just here, though. Just as my calculations predicted. Don't look at me. Got the defense? Answer me. I'll go easy this time. Oops. <laughs> this is our chance. Yeah. I'm asking questions. A test. Let's play for a while. Yeah. Let's go. Huh. Time for a shot. Now time. Damn. Yeah. Thought I was gonna be able to kill him. Just as my calculations predicted. <gasps> Where does this go? Oh, it just loops around. Well, perfect. <gasps> this is so pretty. What is your guys's like? For the people that are caught up to date in every zone, what's your favorite zone? Oh, whoops. I'm sorry, little guy. I forgot about you. The little robot origami crane thing. Oh. This is where you're taking me. Okay, never mind. I was like, we already knew that was there. <gasps> Look at him go. Where are you taking it? Oh, okay. This is the new planet? Ooh, okay, I'm excited to get there. I mean, it didn't take me that long to beat the first planet, I don't think. Mind you, I've been streaming like a fuck ton, so. Okay, bro, where are we going? Thank you. <laughs> Actually, I want to check. Can we warp at all? <gasps> Do we warp, guys? Do we warp? We have enough to warp on this banner again. Are we gambling? Are we gambling? Do we gamble? Maybe we go finish that puzzle first and then we'll gamble. Okay, let me... Ugh. I want tacos. I don't even know what's for dinner. Probably whatever I make, so... Oh god, okay. Um, oh, okay. I'm getting it. I'm getting it now. Okay. 
I'm learning. I'm learning. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's gamble. Let's gamble. Okay, here we go. Mm. Hey, hey, Brayden, I haven't spent any money on this game yet, okay? This is just all me getting it from doing from doing the game, so. We're gambling, but it's free. What are we getting? Oh, it's only purple. Please don't be a light cone. It's gonna be a light cone, isn't it? Why do I feel like it's gonna be a light cone? Or was it that first one that we got? It was that first one. <laughs> I already have that one too, I think. Like, that's the one I have on Natasha at the moment, I think. Actually, yeah. Lame. I hate this game. I'm just kidding. I don't hate it. Oh, shit. My stuff's back. I'll do that up later. Um, how do I check? Record? Is there a record? One, two... Oh, wait. How do you... One, two, three, four, five, six. Seventeen, eighteen, ninety, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty, thirty times. Pixel, hello, hello. I heard you're streaming Pixel now. I need to come catch a stream sometime. Gal had like uh, linked me up, but I was currently busy when you were while you were streaming. So, I must look everywhere. But yeah, I think uh, 30 pulls on that banner. Why? Do I get like, is it like guaranteed at, at like a specific number of pulls? Okay, definitely not challenging that. Hopefully Gal will feel better soon and we can hit up. Yes! I think, she, I think she finally tested negative for COVID, so. Leave it to me! At 90? Oh my god, I'm ages from that. <laughs> Once you hit 300? Oh god, I hope I don't do that. Okay. Also, I learned the hard way that you can't cancel ultimates earlier when I was playing, and I was like, I accidentally fat fingered it. Let's play for a while. <laughs> Let's make it quick. These guys are made to be broken. I don't know what this means, this like flowy shit around him. I could probably check his um yeah. Oh my god. Your answers? Oh my god, he just did so much damage to her. Uh, I don't know who I want to heal. That's better. Much she does more damage. I just have to use this. I have to use it right now. Three hundred. Wait, actually. There's no power team. Did that hurt? Okay, oh my god, I was like, we need this again. We need more, we need more skill points. And we need to heal her. I'm asking questions. I need to take out these guys on the side. Zero points. SAS Pakibi. Wait, what did that say? 
Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Ouch. What the fuck? Rules are made to be broken. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. This is doable. We're okay. No, we're not. We're not okay. I was gonna heal on her turn. Oh no, we might be fucked. Oh, we're definitely fucked. Okay, I might need to like level some people. I don't even know who to go for right now. Let's make it quick. I'm asking questions. I just had some more alts. Oh, nope. Okay, well. We will just fail this and level up some of my people, and I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay. Well, it kept hogging all the five stars I got from the gacha, so I ended up not getting anyone else but Himiko. Holy shit. Damn. Okay, let's redo. Let's just... Wait. I don't even know if I can level people. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Um, oh wait, we can synthesize though. We need four of them. Maybe we'll do that. Oops, no, not that one. We, one, two, three, four. Okay. Whew, okay, we're good. We're good. I'm not done yet. And then I'm just going to get her to 50. Okay. Okay. I also need to ascend this. Okay, clearly I have some farming to do. Later. Okay, we need to ascend him. What do you need? You need six of these. And what was the other thing? What the fuck are these? Where do I get these from? Oh no. Uh oh. I don't know who will be able to all ascend. I challenge it? I only have 60. Shit. I can't make this either. Okay, wait. Three for one. Three times six is 18. Were you shocked just now? Wait, how many do we need? 18? I don't know if I should be doing this at all. Um, this one I could possibly get from here. Just gonna try this once and see how many I get. 
Oh my god, it's a fucking dinosaur with a chef's hat. What the hell? I'm asking questions. A test. I'll go Relax. Let's go. Say bye to bye. Let's play for a while. Stand still. Okay, how many did we get? We got two, okay. We can do it one more time, just barely. Just in time. Your answers? Answer me. Zero points. I'll go easy this time. Relax. Let's make it quick. Well, I'm glad we have temporary access to that because now we can ascend her. Yeah. Let's push the envelope further, shall we? Let's level her up. And how easy is it to ascend you? We need two of these. And then two of these. Damn, I don't think we can. Why is she so hard to ascend? Does she look basic? Mm. Fuck. I don't really like want to use these things. I feel like that's too much to give up. Hmm. I guess I could like eat some stuff before I go in, right? Uh, what do we have? And... Okay. Oh my god, I'm an idiot! No, I, I was using the wrong team. Does she still get the buff? Fuck, she doesn't. Oh my god, that's you funny. Oh, I fucked up. I, I keep forgetting that when you like grab a support, it like, you know, it uh, replaces it. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Zero points. Naughty jewels are made to be broken. <laughs> Much better. Oh no, I shouldn't have done that. Can you find the answer? Oh my god. Oh 
I'm gonna have to use her all. There's no power like team power. Yeah. Just just a I can't let him kill me again, even though he's gonna summon like a Much bunch more better. people. What the fuck? Why does this guy do so much damage? Naughty child. That's better. I'm asking questions. Here's your ult, bro. I need it. I need it. I need it right now. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Okay. Kick him. You got this, girl. Slap him with your little grippers. Oh, finally. Look how many tail hairs I lost on the way. Oh, my beautiful tail. We had a difficult start, but things got easier. Look, that's the barge I was talking about. Mm. Don't fret. This is manual or automatic. All ambassadors know their way around a star skiff. Oh, I was perfectly calm until she volunteered to help. Why does March hate her so much? Please take your seats, Jeez. everyone. We'll be off right away. March, what did she do to you? Oh my god, I almost had a heart attack there. Okay. Oh, with each new um zone like story i guess main story quest that comes out do they up the level of the cap of the characters too or are they like always level 80. What the fuck is this? turn the compass to align the inner and outer okay same point as the navigation Oh, I didn't even know how to do that. Always level 80, okay. Hi, Boone! Hello! What do you mean, EWM playing a gotcha game? I haven't spent any money on it, and it's fun. I'm enjoying the main story. Not Genshin, though. Genshin sucks. I didn't even know that was a puzzle. That just looked like I, I wanted to touch it. <laughs> I mean, everyone likes different games, so... <laughs> like, I'm not a huge fan of FPS games, so I don't go for FPSs, but... Um, I'm enjoying the story, so it's actually pretty legit. On behalf of the Skyfaring Commission, allow me to welcome you to Starskiff Haven. Like, to the point, um, we're on, like, a new area right now, but the previous area we just beat, like, the boss battle was on par with, like... A, a, like a Final Fantasy 14 ending of an expansion so like I was getting chills like that's how crazy cool it was <laughs> on the Sienjo Lafu anything relating to aviation navigation and trade falls within the scope of the Skyfaring Commission which is one of the six commissions of the Lafu as the biggest port on the ship Starskiff Haven is governed by the Skyfaring Commission too you definitely sound like a... Uh, what was it again? Oh, Pammy Cassiter. By which I mean, nice speech. See, what the heck? March, one second she hates her, the next moment she likes her. I can never, I can never tell. My job involves ferrying business delegates to and from Starskiff Haven. So but I, I hope do you're this doing kind well, of introduction Heidi. all the time. Anyway, we're safe now. Normally, I'd be a good host and take you around, but these are difficult times. Let's head to the Palace of Astrum first and report your arrival to Madame Yukon. Palace of Astrum? Right there, the tallest building in the city. It's also the headquarters of the Skyfaring Commission. 
Let's hurry. We haven't got much time. <laughs> really, that makes me laugh because she's literally born out of ice. <laughs> like, her home MO should be chill. What's the hurry? I don't mean to rush you, but if Madame Yukong holds me accountable for not getting you over soon enough, I wouldn't want to be around for the consequences. Sounds scary. I thought you said she was kind-hearted. We need to make a few preparations before paying a visit to any of the six commissions. Rest assured, Miss Tingyun, we won't go anywhere. If you can inform Madame Yukong of our arrival first, we'll meet you at the palace entrance later. Very well. I mean, she could literally just tell her, like, hey, they weren't ready to come meet you yet. They literally just battled their whole way over here. And died once. <laughs> Little Miss Fox moves at quite the pace. I can't keep up with her. Because you're old. Uh, I've spent too long on the bench. Just kidding, I don't know his age. Let's catch our breath for a while, huh? We can expect a packed schedule ahead. That I'm might be a little a slide, harsh, then. but she does put her own interests first. She did the right thing by not trusting us initially. We were an unknown quantity to her. <laughs> Throwing shade on his age, rush, yeah. Uh, I don't know how old he is. <laughs> she's just eager to get us out of her hair and further up the chain. Uh, the Yukong's, uh, sounds It'll like be a right. We're not trying to stand in her way. We have nothing to hide from her. <laughs> we didn't have anything to hide in Bellabog either. A march, jeez. <laughs> not so fast. I need to give you two a heads up first. Our meeting with Madame Yukon won't be without risk. We need to be prepared and take it seriously. She is a top Sienjo leader. Oh, Mr. Yang, do you think this could be Bellabog all over again? Mm. Let me guess they're going to put us no, up in a hotel Sienjo first. Alliance is better than that. But Madame Yukong will definitely have a string of difficult questions for us. Why did we choose to come to the Sienjo now? How did we know that the incident is related to Estelleron? Who leaked their information to us? Careless answers mean distrust oh, no. and potential hostility, which would make things much harder for us. The last time we tried to like debate or whatever, oh, we did terrible. God. One of us is going to blurt something out or get something wrong. I Bruh, that's you, it. March. What are you fucking talking about? Okay, thank you for the gifts of to Brayden. Someone good. Someone that's here, not Post Malone. <laughs> Can you imagine if Post Malone just like stopped by my chat and was like, hi? Uh, I'm gonna say Mr. Good Yang idea. should do the talking. We can be his cheerleaders in the background. Let's not do that. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll find a way through. Oh, is this her? How'd you get my number? What? Let's talk it out, not fight. Benefactor, Benefactor, I'd like to ask you something. What is it? There must be another way. This may be disrespectful, but I'm very curious. Is the Express really here just to help Sancho Lafu solve the Stellar problem? Yes. Why? Oh, is it really that hard to understand why the Express is here? Can't someone act simply out of the kindness of their heart? After all, people who help others without thinking of compensation or risks during the dangerous trips across the cosmos is rarer than air in a vacuum. When the higher-ups of, uh, I'm not even gonna say that, <laughs> just uh, first heard of your reasons for coming, they thought you were here to either seek immortality or the sem Stellaron. Seek immortality. It's absolutely forbidden here, right? Yeah, as the home of long life species, countless elixir seekers from all corners of the universe come to come here to reenact bygone histories. Oh my god, girl, you talk too fast. Um, and discover the secret of the resident's immortality. Apologies, I may have crossed that the line. I don't know why I said all this. I have the absolute, I have absolute trust in your sincerity, benefactor. But the powerful masters are bound to think more than upon like me. So please be careful. Will do. Oh, I just liked. Um. I think Obama could use a sub here to be honest. <laughs> Dude, I don't know what I'd do if a former U.S. president just came in here and started chatting my stream. Obama, what's your favorite character? 
Who's your favorite summon? Sorry, I'm just kind of like running around. Looking at everything. You know, I feel like there's way less like collectibles on this world. I feel like in Bellabog there was like one every single fucking like step I took. How big is this city? Oh, she quite large. Oh, okay. Go no further. Oh, okay. Never mind. I've been halted. Let's go. Mm. <gasps> I clicked the ball. <gasps> Here they all are. Sorry to keep you waiting. Madame Yukong is expecting you. Are you not coming? I've brought the Madame Helmmaster up to speed. It's over to you now. Oh god, I'm scared. Yes, madam. Report the losses to General Jing Yuan and find someone from the Divination Commission. I can't just stand there watching while we deal with this mess. Hello. Greetings, guests from the Astral Express. Wait, I want a picture of her. She's pretty. Thank you. <laughs> Ting Yun has informed me of the purpose of your visit. Receiving guests isn't normally one of my responsibilities. Do all the immortal people have tails? Since Are they all you foxes? Know about the Stellaron and have stated that you want to help the Long Fu, I thought I should at least meet you in person and politely decline your proposal. Rick. Why? I'd fluff her tail, yeah, me too. Also, hi, The Sienjo Alliance knows what a Stellaron is and is more than capable of handling it ourselves. We have been around for over 8,000 years and weathered countless dangers and crises. Chat has to hydrate. While the situation is serious, we have more than enough resources to spare. Outsider help is not needed on this occasion. You are guests from afar. There is no reason for this matter to concern. Helping is our job and we want to help. Let clear. us help. From what we've gathered, the influence of the Stellaron can still be contained. If we can locate it in time and contain it, it's possible that we can restore any space and any individuals affected by the corrosion. We have experience in preventing Stellaron disasters, and we've only come here to lend you that experience. I've said this and I'll say it again. This is an internal affair of the Sienjo Alliance, and there is no need for the Astral Express to get involved. I decided to arrange a meeting with you as a gesture of respect, but my decision is final. Uh, but... Never mind, Mr. Yang. If the Sienjo Alliance say they can handle it, then we're wasting our breath. Let's go. I'm afraid that's impossible. What? Are we prisoners on this planet too? Huh? And what's that supposed to mean? It's only been a few days since the presence of a Stellaron was detected on the Law Fu. Starskiff Haven has been under full lockdown. No one has been permitted to leave. How did you come to know of the incident? And what led you to conclude that it was linked to a Stellaron? Oh shit. I forgot they named her after the date they found her. <laughs> I acquired the access history of Starskiff Haven. Not long ago, someone hacked into the system and opened the Jade Gate, before guiding you, the Astral Express, into our territory. The hacker was skillful and even taunted us with her seal. Her <gasps> name Silver is Wolf. Silver Wolf, a member of the Stellaron Hunters. What say you in your defense? 
Uh oh. Interrogation's not my it's not my strong point. Oh no. Do I just say dots? I don't know. We suck at interrogations. Or do we just be honest? Mm. Yeah, right. It's me. It was me all along. Yeah, I'm definitely not going to say the Stellar on Hunters wanted you to, wanted you wanted to use you to take us out. I don't know what. Uh, if I say nothing, that's just as bad as saying something. Oh my goodness. I'm just going to say they told us to. Yang's like, you what the fuck? You are forbidden from leaving the Skyfaring Commission until the aforementioned questions have been investigated. Don't be too harsh, you gong. If this gets oh, out, hello. the whole galaxy will think the Alliance has forgotten how to treat our guests. General Jingyuan. I like him. I like him. He's cute. It's very He's unlikely so that the Express has joined forces with the Stellaron Hunters. Oh. They are mortal <laughs> enemies, after all. Apologies for interrupting your meeting. No, My good thing you did, Jingyuan. sir. Good thing you I'm did. the general of the Cloud Knights here on the Law Fu. General, this is an internal affair for the Law Fu. No, fuck off, bitch. Let this guy talk. I fully agree with you, Helm Master Yukon. This is indeed an internal affair. I am sorry, guess of the Astral Express. It is true that there is a Stellaron on the Law Fu, but I'm afraid I cannot accept your kind offer to help resolve the issue. This is a <laughs> oh, Sin Joe matter, and it is our responsibility to handle it. <laughs> of course, it would be inappropriate of me to let you return without something to show for it. While I cannot accept your help with like regard to the Stellaron, I do have a favor to ask. Please, after I you. thought he was gonna let us help. Ah, <sighs> the Astral Express. I must confess that the train's reputation precedes it. Such that it is often close to my thoughts. How delightful to come face to face with its passengers. Um, what it's this location in you, General. Uh, may I ask what the favor? I wouldn't mind being in the middle of the meeting. Ah, uh, a matter that requires capable people such as yourselves. We captured a member of the Stellaron Hunters a few days ago who goes by the name of Blade. During our investigation, the Divination Commission, the department in charge of intelligence processing, intercepted a transmission sent out by his accomplice, Kafka, who has managed to hide aboard the ship. As for where that transmission was Around destined... Us. The Express. I mean, I already told them earlier. I have some knowledge of your relationship with the Stellaron Hunters. The Divination Commission is convinced that you made an alliance with them. <laughs> I say that's impossible. The crew of the Astral Express are honorable people whose valiant deeds are lauded across the universe. There must have been a misunderstanding. As such, I came to the conclusion that the communication must have been an attempt by the Stellaron Hunters to sow dissent between us. That's right, we've been framed. Or maybe we can they have other the Stellaron, but it will take time and will require the bulk of the Cloud Knights on the ship. And it's this Kafka that concerns me. The longer she stays on the ship, the bigger the threat she will pose. Since the Stellaron Hunters lured you to our ship, we shall move with the current. You are hereby authorized to do as you deem fit on the Damn, they just gave us full access to everything? Okay. Kafka out of the <laughs> yeah, right. Blade. Our control. It's like that movie. That Doing movie. so would clear the misunderstanding between us, reveal the true intentions of the Stellaron Hunters, and help us understand their connection to the Stellaron Burst. What say you, my astral guest? Hmm. What do you think? Let's move and help with the current. If you are thingy. able to capture this Stellaron hunter, the Sien Zhou will be indebted to you. The La Fu never fails to reward that which is given. Okay. Wonderful. It's a deal then. I shall notify Yu Kong that all intel is to be shared with you, and that our best personnel are to aid you in your search. 
If there is anything the Skyfaring Commission or the Cloud Knights can do for you during your stay, don't hesitate to make it known. Chat concluded and well shot you a covert gesture. You understand that this is the crew's own discussion time. Oh, wow. Is that cool? We're just gonna talk right next to her? We don't want to go outside? I think we only scratched the surface of this General Jing Yuan. Uh, do you think there's something I strange about him? I don't know about strange, but my gut tells me something is off. Mm -hmm. ah, that's it. A minor detail, but curious. He avoided talking about Blade. Since the Cloud Knights have already captured a Stellaron hunter, why not use him to get to Kafka? Huh? Why rely on us? The Cienjo is reluctant to involve outsiders in the Stellaron disaster, so why is it so keen on letting us capture a Stellaron hunter? True. Do you think you could align yes. with the Stellaron? The only sensible conclusion I can draw is that Blade had already escaped when Jing Yuan spoke to us, provided they even captured him in the first place. Wait, that was not the option I picked. <laughs> Therefore, given our connection to Kafka, we represent the only way of luring the Stellaron hunters in. That's why he asked for our help. He didn't want to let anyone else find out that Blade had already escaped. Now that we've figured that out, Perhaps we can get closer to the core of what's happening here. We really jumped to conclusions here, didn't we? <laughs> what the fuck? I would have never guessed that. Hello? Is there actually anything in this building that I can break? Hello, lady. Oh. Sorry. Okay, I don't care what Anso say. I just wanted to pick up the shiny. Just wanted to pick up the shiny. Xiao Kong Plow 6 is overloaded. Please have people evacuated to other docks ASAP. Over. I understand how you must feel, but please stay calm. Oh. Interesting statue. Okay. Let's go back down. Master oh. Diviner, <laughs> you heard our discussion. What do you make of it? What do I make of it? <gasps> the scroll. way of heaven is apparent. But the heart of humanity is often deceptive. Are you asking me to divine their true intentions? That won't be necessary. The crew has nothing to do with the incident. Of that, I am almost certain. It isn't their intentions that trouble me. All I want is for them to lure out the one we're after. Wasn't that my idea, General? Indeed. Your counsel has always been a great help to me. You may use your discretion on the matters ahead of us. Why don't you retire early and I use my discretion full time? <laughs> it is still too soon, unfortunately. If something goes wrong, you'll need a general to take the blame. How could I simply walk away and put you at such risk? If you'd brought me that blade earlier, none of this would have been necessary. Wait, what are you up to exactly? Jing Yuan, did you let him escape on purpose? Me? <laughs> I had no idea he might escape. Unlike you, my gaze never travels beyond the horizon. I take full responsibility. The Cloud Knights failed in their duty. <laughs> I can understand. There's a lot to take care of on the Xinjo. You are bound to miss something. Thank goodness I'm here. <laughs> on that note, 
Perhaps it's about time you finally nominate me as your successor when the Six Charioteers next convene. Yes, yes, yes. I have to go now. I'll leave this in your overwhelmingly capable hands, Fushen. <sighs> there are three things in the world that I can't seem to rid myself of. The troubles of the Sienjo, the papers on my desk, and the weeds in my garden. <laughs> General, Diviner Fu wants the General's position for herself. Everyone knows that. She is very capable, but her intellect is burdened by a quick temper. I'll retire when she's achieved a better balance. This Stellaron thing is also easy. Looks super fucking young, escaped. and is now he not immortal? Get him, get him. Just say the word, and I'll solve this in a flash. I can understand your impatience, and I know you want to prove yourself. Now is not the time. If you truly wish to become sword champion, you shouldn't be running around brandishing your sword at people, especially not a major criminal. You think I'd lose to Blade? Yes. I'm saying you need to have patience, Yan Ching. Governing Xianzhou is different from a sword fight. The only way to build momentum is to work slowly. Besides, right, Cypher? We still don't know who's really moving the chess pieces. There is something we must take care of before making our next move. As long as it remains unresolved, we're at a stalemate. That something is the Stellaron. How did it manage to bypass the Skyfaring Commission's inspections and the Divination Commission's predictions? Where is it now? I say we bring those two Stellaron hunters before Diviner Fu. She'll get an answer out of them in no time. I've asked our friends from the Express to take care of that for us. Worry not, you'll have your moment when the current stalemate is broken. You are my most trusted aid, and there are some things that I would only assign to you. Speaking of which, Yang Ching, <sighs> that boy, I suppose it is my fault. I should have given him an opportunity already. A sharp sword can't stay sheathed forever. Damn, they're making him sound so epic. My like fear is that this might prove too big a setback. <laughs> Bigger than his exuberance. Oh, she's calling us again. Seems like you will take a bit longer to chat with Madame Yukon. I'm gonna go have a stroll outside. Once you're done, you can find me at the docks. Oh, okay. I'll come see you. Hello, girly. <sighs> Madame Yukong has asked me to look after you. Seems like we were destined to be in each other's company. The Skyfaring Commission has reserved rooms for you at the Petrichor Inn. When you finish your business here, how about some tea together? The hotel again. Thank Not you. at all. Though I'd appreciate it if you mentioned to Madame Yukong that you got a warm reception from me when you next see her. <sighs> Better to be busy than idle, I suppose. Okay, where's this in? I can't get a read on her tone, I know, right? <laughs> Makes picking the options hard. Well, here we are. I feel sleepy already. That's not like you, March. You're always ready to go for the adventure. Hey, that's not fair. My eyes are peeled this time. I'll make a run for it the second things go wrong. Uh, jokes aside, did you see Madame Yukong frown at us? I thought her guards were about to jump out of nowhere and throw us in jail. Oh, I'd rather deal with monsters than these big shots. Uh, I mean, not that Madame Yukong doesn't have her merits. <laughs> Don't worry, my lips are sealed. But as her subordinate, I have to say that it's Madame Yukong's duty to keep her guard up. The Law Fu is facing a crisis, and as head of the Sky Faring Commission, she is responsible for the security of the Sienjo's customs and borders. She's actually a very reasonable old girl in private. 
<laughs> reasonable. They say that many years ago, Madame Yukong was an ace pilot in the Cloud Knights. She was a work hard, play harder type, known for her hot temper and incredible skill. Eventually, she became the head of the entire commission, which required her to learn patience and adopt a meticulous approach to her work. In any case, Madame Yukong instructed me to reserve the best rooms at the inn and have all your expenses Yay. covered. She wants to extend the full courtesy of the Sienjo so that all of you enjoy your stay to the fullest. She specifically mentioned that if you wish to buy anything at the inn, be it food or otherwise, just let the innkeeper know. The commission will cover the cost. Mm. The commission will cover the cost. <laughs> what was that That's like? That's the friendliest thing I've heard since we arrived. <clears throat> Seeing as our hosts are so thoughtful, I guess we should help ourselves. Right, Mr. Yang? We should focus on our objective first. Seeing as Hellmaster Yukong was extremely reluctant to get us involved, am I right to speculate that the Skyfaring Commission has some leads on the whereabouts of Kafka? Oh, well, it's straight to business. Exactly right. The yeah, right, unlimited is food. Cunning. She encrypted her transmission and timed her communication. We couldn't pinpoint her exact location. But as cunning as she is, the Divination Commission has managed to find something. <gasps> Here are the coordinates. It's up to you how to proceed. Our destinations may differ, but the orbits of the stars will eventually converge. See you later. Mm. I heard something in the background. I didn't. Precisely. Never mind, it's right. <laughs> That's the sound of a device. Uh, which means what exactly? This is a starship. There are all kinds of devices making weird noises. Miss March, to the untrained ear, these noises may sound the same, but for the craftsmen of the Artisanship Commission, every machine has a different pitch and melody. <laughs> They'll never the know, Cypher. They'll never know. And they concluded that the sound came from the shipyard facilities in Stargazer Navalia. Now, get some rest and prepare yourselves for the operation ahead. I look forward to seeing you in action. Let's take advantage of the rest. It won't be easy to track down Kafka the Stellaron Hunter. Oh! Let's let the Express know how we're doing. More importantly, let's see how Don Hung's doing. <laughs> Ask him what he's up to. Then tell him we're having loads of fun. She's evil. I'm gonna text him. Hey, you guys doing alright? Message failed to send. What? Are you okay? Message failed to send? Did he block me? He fucking blocked me. He's the one who asked for my number in the beginning. Rude ass. You've been standing here for half an hour. It's probably hour. sad that I replaced him it's with Dr. Ratio. <laughs> Are you worried about those two? Weld is with them. They should be fine. Just zoom in and hit. <laughs> Himiko, did you keep a copy of the Stellaron Hunter's transmission? Of course she did. Can I have a look? Sure. Not to mention, 45 system hours ago, a Stellaron burst, an unexpected collision. What exactly are you Stellaron hunters trying to do? The Sienjo Alliance aren't us. They won't give you to- Stop speaking in riddles, Kafka. <sighs> so I'm kind of skipping it, because we already heard it. That Stellaron has nothing to do with us, but- Stop! Do you know him? The Sancho is in danger. This man, he... Why is he, like, looking? If he's on the ship, then Welt March and her... Everyone is in grave danger. What? Is he connected to that oh, past you want to escape? Dan should know Ratio was the correct choice, right? <laughs> I... 
I can't leave them down there. It's just... I'm afraid my burden has finally caught up with me. And that everyone is about to be drawn in. Is there anyone who doesn't carry around a past burden? She may not remember it, but even a girl as carefree as March has hers. We tread on a path that is hidden from us. The things we see and the trails we blaze all become our baggage. They weigh us down, but they also give us strength to continue the journey. Try not to dwell on it, Don Hung. The Express spends seven standard days at each stop. Its passengers are allowed to do as they deem fit during that time. Pom Pom and I are more than capable of looking after the Express. If there's something you've got to do, do it now. Better than regretting it further down the line. <laughs> Dan got helpless for Ishiodio. <laughs> Sorry, boy, we didn't need a wind and, and a yellow and one on once the team. This is all over, right? Sus. Wait, what? Playing as him now? Oh, what the? Oh, it says failed to send to. I'll go find you folks. Why is our like send the message out. transmission being cut off? The network is down, but some functions still work. Um. Just like my own little area. I must explore in case there's treasure. Why do I feel like I run so much faster with this guy? What the heck? I feel like I'm zooming. Wee. Wee. Feel fast as fuck. Virtually nothing has changed since I left. Apart from darkness, this... too late to repent. I've no interest in con. Damn wrecked. What does top off? Nothing has changed since I left. Oh, apart from darkness. This place is all that I remember of the lawful. Shattered Cloud Knight armor. A conflict with the Cloud Knights? Mm, not likely. Mr. Yang wouldn't let that happen. I was gonna say, we look like we got dropped off at a different area, kind of. Oh, who are these people? What the fuck? Stay where you are. I can handle this. Emergencies should be dealt with by professionals. Luo Luocha? Luocha? Is that this girl? Her fit is cute. I just joined. Yo, what's up? You needed me, didn't you? What does she do? Oh my goodness. Should I just use her ult for fun? I kind of want to use it. I don't know what it looks like. Oh shit. Oh my god, she summoned a chicken. What the fuck? <laughs> oh wait, it didn't die yet. That's okay. Ooh, I like her. Oh shit, maybe I should have waited. Truth of life and death. I didn't realize this was a multi-battle uh, fight. <laughs> okay, I got prog soon, so I'll have to be working. No worries, I'm actually going to end stream soon here. I only wanted to stream for like two hours. So, you ain't missing out. Oh no. Really? It's got like one life left. Uh oh, do we have to redo that? Mm. 
With you two risking your lives for me, could I really stay where I am? Wait, who's this guy? Was that coded? Was that supposed to happen? Move yeah, no worries, Connor. Good luck with your um your frog. Wanna see what I can do? The truth of life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision. Break. I wanna use his thing. Actually, maybe I should say that. Going anywhere. Oh wait, he's just doing his own shit. What the fuck? Too late to repent. Um, I feel like I could just beat up the main guy. Oh, I don't actually like play him. He does his own thing. Okay. <laughs> wait, which one is Lu Luoka? Okay, the guy. Look at him. Look at his hair. <gasps> he's looking at me. Good. The I'm fuck was that? I'm Neither of us spoke. I was just transferred here from the Yaoqing. Well, I did tell you to let me handle it. I don't have eyes in the back of my head. What if I accidentally hit you? Forgive me, miss, but you were too busy being hit yourself. It's a good thing I joined the fray. <laughs> I was protecting you, more like. It's a Cloud Knight's job to protect others. And this area is under martial law. I'm escorting all civilians. Wow, this voice actor actually, like, talks like normal in my opinion like the speed that was some impressive cloud knight spearmanship which unit are you from nowhere i was born here i'm not a cloud knight huh okay you're a civilian then come with me miss sushang what exactly has transpired here in all my trade visits i've never seen star skiff haven in such a state i uh i can't comment on that I was just ordered to rescue the civilians. The chicken stomp is too cute. No idea either. Anyway, you two just need to come with me. Hey, you're pretty quiet. What's your name? I've got forms to fill out. Can't put your name down as blank. My name is Don Hung. I'm a traveler. I'm on my way to meet up with my friends. I appreciate the help, but I can leave the port on my own. No can do, mister. It's way too late. You won't find anyone at Starskiff Haven. If your friends made it out, then they'll already be in the safe zone. Aren't you going to take my name too, miss? <laughs> you already said it when we were busy fighting. La... something. Lo Cha! Is that right? Cha. <laughs> I remember it. Let's go. Stay close, you two. Cloud Knight Sushang will guarantee your safety. I mean, I feel like we're both stronger than her. <laughs> oh, one but okay. more thing. I need you to write your names down later. I don't know too many characters. I might make a mistake. She's cute. Message not sent. Why not? Um, Long range right? communication technology is still improving. Perhaps the presence of the Stellaron is affecting signal transmission. Doesn't seem like it. Everything else is working fine. See? In that case, it looks like someone wants to make things difficult for us. Since Kafka's here, I wouldn't be surprised if this turns out to be that Stellaron hunter hacker girl's handiwork. <gasps> I leveled up. Think you'd get away with your crime by pretending to be a waiter? Oh, you've arrived. Um, it's hard to oh, be waiting. No. Only an extra couple of hours. Stargazer Navalia is governed by the Artisanship Commission. It took me a while to sort out our paperwork. I got a sense of the situation on my way back. Just like at Cloudford, Stargazer Navalia's Meridian Pin has malfunctioned. The checkpoint there is abandoned, and the garrison is scrambling to locate the Stellaron. With monsters wreaking havoc and the knights scattered, Stargazer Navalia has become a perfect place for the suspect to hide out. <sighs> so we've got a bunch of monsters to deal with, an IPC most wanted Stellaron hunter to catch, and we have to do all that on our own without reinforcements? Well, fair enough. 
this isn't our first rodeo. Oh, March. <laughs> um, that's just what we do every day. <laughs> the trailblazing life for you. I wouldn't say you're entirely on your own. <laughs> when you're ready, let's get going. Okay. I'm going to call it here for now, though, just because I only wanted to stream for, like, two hours, so... Um, let's go see what other people are up to. Um, 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 that was really good. I think, I feel like we made a lot of, a lot of progress. Um, I feel like I will probably stream tomorrow as well. <laughs> uh, probably earlier in the day because I do not work on Saturdays. So then we can really dive into the core of this story. So that'll be cool. Um, and I'm probably going to like... You know, just level up my character. Freaking. <laughs> um, I need to level up my character. I need to ascend my other two characters or like figure out how to get the materials better or whatnot. Um, and I need to. I think I have so many relics and stuff that I should probably like pick which ones go well with them and stuff like that. Like there's there's definitely other things I can level that I feel like are under leveled at the moment that are definitely gonna help me in fights. So I might like google that tonight or like look up a guide or something so but i already know who i want to take us to because i want to be on brand with we were just in a city with cute little foxes so i'm gonna take us to another city or another city with a fox a streamer who's also a fox that we went to last time where I'm, I'm gonna take a, take us on over to uh koyo because she's fucking playing phasmophobia and i just played some last night with like zero and l and kibbs in the chat and had a lot of fun so i kind of want to take us over there and see um yeah yeah Yes, I will. I hope everyone has a good rest of their Friday too. Um, if I don't stream tomorrow, but it is highly likely I will stream tomorrow, uh, then I will probably stream on Sunday um, as uh, as well. Cause yeah, I need to get into the story. Like wh why did they take us here? Why are they being so sussy? Like what the heck, you know? So, but yeah, I hope everyone has a good night. Stay hydrated. Don't party too hard. And we're gonna go on over to Koyo. I will see you guys tomorrow or Sunday. Bye. Bye-bye.